So guys, anaitwa Ngoma, Ngoma anaitwa Mango C and I'm pretty sure you got to hear it first could be the playlist ya 101.5 Times FM. Good music and unstop entertainment is what we do best. And yes, he's in the house all the way from Cameroon. How you doing? I'm doing very good and you? Good. You speak Swahili? Nah, I just know uh Asante, <laughs> Asante. I know Karibu, uh-huh. I know uh Mambo. Wo wo wo. Wo wo wo. What do you like about wo 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 first? Uh I guess yeah, it just told me means uh booty. Be, booty. Yeah, yeah, it means booty and Santa has a lot booty. of beautiful women. Like, you like booty too? Of course. Who doesn't like booty? <laughs> He doesn't. Really? That's a weird fact. <laughs> But, so is this your first time to be in Tanzania? Yeah, first time, first week. Okay, how do you find the, uh, how do you find Bongo? It's great. It's great the food the, the The food. Yeah. The, What have you tried from Bongo? I've eaten uh there's this uh had a mashaki, had a mishkaki. Mishkaki. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> And so I tried the uh, lamb chops too. I've never eaten lambs in my oh, life. Oh, so okay. I, I tried lamb chops and uh, the pork chops too were very delicious. I, I had a uh, lunch yesterday at Mediterranean. Okay. Yeah, it was very delicious. So the food is great and the environment is overall. And the women are fine. They're fine <laughs> and the people uh, themselves are very welcoming like yourself. So in Bongo we call our music Bongo flavor in Tanzania, Kenya they call it Genge music. What do you call your music from your country? We call it uh, m- Kame. 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 Yeah. It's just Kame. Kame music. Nice. Come yeah. music. Yeah. So uh, I heard, actually, I, I read it somewhere that uh, you actually you went through uh, political science and IT. Yeah. And then you couldn't like go on with music because <laughs> your parents were actually really strict with you with music. Yeah. How was that for you? It was really difficult because every dream of African parents is that all oh, their children should go to school and get yeah. these degrees and stuff like that. But I had to maybe uh, pretend to my mom I was doing the school by mm-hmm. uh, studying IT, but I was really not pretending because I really loved uh, doing IT. I started building websites in mm-hmm. 2011, and uh, it was giving me some money, and that's what I started putting into my music. And definitely, I had uh, the opportunity to shoot a few videos on myself. Okay. And I'm still solo up till today. Okay. So thank God for that. I love your song. Mango C. I don't know what you're saying. I don't know what you mean. <laughs> Mango- but it's something I could just, you know, bang my head to every time I listen to it. Oh, what does it mean? Mango C means strong. Strong. Yeah, I mean okay. strong. It's actually uh, a medicinal tree. It's a, okay. Yeah, so it's a really rare tree which is used for many, many medicinal purposes in Cameroon. Okay. Yeah, Have so- you ever tried it? Okay. So, kwa sababu kuna jamangu hapa yuko So, jamaa anaitwa Ngoma, sawa ametokea Cameroon. Yeah, yuko amekuja kutambulisha ngoma yake inaitwa Mango C. Mango C kwao kule ni ni kama kitu fulani hivi kama dawa fulani ya kienyeji. Mtishamba wenye nguvu sana. We, wenye nguvu sana. Kwa hiyo tuelewane hivyo. Lakini pia jamaa pia amesomea mambo ya IT na vitu vingine vingine vinavyofanana na hivyo. Tuendelee. Mimi niko hapa mtafsiriji mzuri kabisa ili tuelewane wote. How old are you? Quick question. I'm 24. 24. Cameroon <laughs> refers to you as the most talented rapper and you're just 24. How is that? <laughs> It feels, it feels great like you know the the, the praise comes from the fans so mm-hmm. i actually had to start the game rapping my dialect and four languages i uh-huh. was the first person to do that how many languages do you speak i speak four languages uh-huh wow. in my dialect i speak uh, pigeon pigeon english like swahili english okay. english and french french yeah. bonjour <laughs> no, <I'm not> <laughs> bonjour don't go there <laughs> <laughs> okay, so I also read somewhere that you're also a magician. Are you a lyricist magician or are you a magician magician? No, I just like magic maybe. Can yeah. you show us some tricks? Mm. We got the camera here. We'll post it on YouTube. No, I can show the, I don't have the tools here. What you know, tools do you need? Maybe we can find some for you. Ah, uh, coins. <laughs> maybe we can do that in private then I'll show you a little. Oh, okay, I'm Yeah, I don't want to scare that, my right. fans away to think this is a magician rapper okay. and he's going to play gimmicks on a song. So, so since you've been here in Tanzania, it's been a week. Have you met any artists from Tanzania that you might want to like include in your uh, next work? Yeah, I, I guess I've met a few. Uh, I've met a few. Uh, no, no, no. I haven't met a few. I'm supposed to meet Chin Bees today. Chin Bees. Yeah. Have you heard the songs? Yeah, I've heard the songs. Which uh, one of Kababa Ye? Yeah, it's really lit. Song. Kababa Ye. Yeah. yeah, I love the video. <laughs> we'll too. play it for you. <laughs> okay. Yeah, and I have a poison. Yeah. Okay. Um. So, uh, you're on your way to. Re- I mean, uh, you're actually uh releasing your brand new album, uh, mm-hmm. greatest of all time. Of all time. Yeah. Can I get the? Uh, what's the concept behind that one? Uh, well, it's generally my life. Within the past five years, from okay. the age of 20, I started music in, at 19. Mm-hmm. So from the age of 20 to 25, I, I 
I, I get to like say how these experiences are faced as a musician mm -hmm. and also like a human being as a whole because I'm a businessman apart from music. Uh -oh. So that's why most of the times I get to talk about money and uh, it's just to wake this awakening amongst youth. I would not say Cameroon but Africa as a whole. Like many people sleep on the level so I want the album to be able to pass that message to make sure that youth understand that they are the owners of tomorrow. Okay, okay. that is very powerful. Yeah, thank that you. is very nice. <laughs> so again, are you going to have any collaborations from any with any artists from Tanzania in your album? Def in my album? Yes. Yeah, yeah. Who, who, who? Give me some <laughs> scoop, please. I don't know yet. Like, I'm just new like, to Tanzania. Like, who are you thinking of right here? Like, have you heard Vanessa Mde? Have you heard Ali Kiba? I'm sure you're familiar with Kibis. I like Ali Kiba. You like Ali Kiba? Yeah. Diamond like Platinum? Yeah, Vanessa too. I think those are the most three prominent I know before coming to Tanzania. Okay. But I've gotten to discover Rivani, uh, Chimbis, I guess a couple names. I can't really remember. Okay. Yeah, so I hope maybe to mm -hmm. feature with them before I go back to Cameroon within nice. my short holiday time. So for how long will you be here? Uh, my schedule, I have a flight back on the 21st. 21st? Yeah. Okay, we'll work something out. Okay, then. definitely. <laughs> <laughs> Jamie, you got any questions? Uh, my question is, is like, um, why, wh why are you choosing Tanzania instead of other countries like Kenya? We have Rwanda, yeah, our neighbors. Why do you choose Tanzania and not other countries? I, I think the Tanzanian industry is really like, uh, it's open. Open, and, huh? Yeah, it's open, yeah. like it's not just to one country, it's to Kenya and to Uganda. So if you get to get to the core of where this East African music comes from, then you can really relate to all of these people around East Africa. And uh, also to that fact, I like the place, it's beautiful. Amongst other, yeah, wow. It's the most beautiful country I'd loved, I, would, I had loved to visit in Africa. Okay. And mostly Zanzibar, I, I, I still have to go there next week. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah you should, you yeah. should. Okay, you should, have, you should try eating the pueza the from pueza. there. Yeah, just ask them for pueza if you like seafood. Okay. You go to no, Forozani. No, I, don't, I don't like you don't seafood, like seafood. It's, it's, it's too sweet. No, 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 pueza is not sweet. It's actually spicy and salty. Really nice. Oh, really? Yes. I, I, I you should try, try it. it. Thanks for the recommendation. All right. <laughs> so, um, you had a song called Kamer Oboso. I hope I pronounced it right. Yeah, Kamer Oboso. So it got leaked and then it got a yeah. massive airtime in South Africa. Everybody <laughs> was playing it without your consent. How was that for you? Yeah, up to today, I've not been able to release that song. But I hope, I, I hope I'll put it in the album just because it got leaked. Okay. So maybe I'm going to do another version of it. But it was really, really enormous. Like, Cameroonians out in South Africa I had to, like, hit it up with the DJs. I had many videos sent to me. It was mm -hmm. really great. Coming out, like, it was the second song. I recorded so people life. loved it yeah they did love it <laughs> you should yeah, really it's a Cameroonian song it. so I'm okay. like oh Cameroon like it sounds like somebody can say Tanzania hooray Tanzania yeah. Yeah, something like that <laughs> alright um, next question you get your inspiration from Prince then again T.I. then again Morgan Heritage yeah. I look at Prince and he's all pop rock and roll I look at Morgan Heritage he's all like <laughs> Reggae, whatever, uh -huh. whatever, and then Ti, he's strictly hip hop. Mm -hmm. How do you fuse that all together and become you? I'm not just a rapper. That's the difference. Yeah, you're too. a singer too. Yeah, I'm a uh -huh. singer too, and I get to like put in these Afro melodies. When I say uh, Prince is an inspiration, doesn't mean I listen to him up to date. Okay. Yeah, my my dad used to play a lot of his of late now. Yeah. Yeah, he used to play a lot of his songs, so we always used to have. I'm CDs sorry of, for your loss, by the way. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> of Prince and Morgan uh -huh. Heritage at home. So those were the most CDs we had playing at home so listening to this all the time the melody is still stick in my head so when i'm writing i get to like maneuver through the beat and put in those melodies same okay. thing with uh, morgan heritage mm -hmm. but i do still listen to him right now i uh this uh this album oh, i forgot the title i forgot the title I don't even know his music that well. <laughs> I guess on my phone, so I... Okay. <laughs> and T.I.? T.I. is just like the... Like, he inspired me most. Like, he's the one who actually yeah. made me to start rapping. Okay. Yeah. What do you love most about T.I.? He's fast and he, he, you can listen to him. You can listen to he's him. He's really fast. His love can... life doesn't inspire you in any type of way. Uh... He's got girls, yo. <laughs> <laughs> I'm a lover, so I don't know. Maybe he can change in the future, but... I'm just taking music about T.I. Ah, that's dope. Yeah. Can you give us a couple of bars? I can try. What? Okay, I think you should go with this one. Okay. Okay. <coughs> oh, it's too slow. Something hotter, maybe. Okay. Let me find something like hotter. Hip -hop. Something like hip-hop. Something like hip-hop. Future mask off, will that do with you? Future mask, no, 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 no. no. Okay. That's too trappy. <laughs> <laughs> you don't like trap? Uh, I like trap, but I like putting Afro melodies in there. Tupac, how do you want it? Mm, okay. Hit him up. Hit him up, but let's try. Okay, let's go with hit him <coughs> up. Show him how it is. Show us how it is in Cameroon, yo. <laughs> 
Yeah. Started off a young boy, a young black boy, still a young black boy to the bone, to the core. You see me, I black like Kunta, but my shoe the black too. Black to the bone, but I got white teeth, fresh like Coco Leaf. I enter the place like a Kuncha, six manga. I buy small mouth, I take them for pocket, I take them and put them for my qua. Take it go for hours, then I knock them two times. Whoa, 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 I had a whoa, whoa, whoa. It's hey, a real. <laughs> no, 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 go, 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 whoa, 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 uh huh. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, Tanzania is a really great place, beautiful people, beautiful people, really great food, and I had to eat to my belly full, belly full, belly full. I got it on the top of my head, like I ain't gotta smoke a lot, and don't do smoking around you. Mm-hmm. They, they really don't. They don't. Yeah. Do you smoke though? Yeah. Oh, kush or something? Uh, you got cigarettes out all. You I like smoke. the cannabis? I smoke. You <laughs> smoke. Okay. I want to know how you came to meet Skywalker. Um. Uh, He, I got hooked up uh, with uh, the manager of One NS Studios, so mm-hmm. Sky, he, he hooked us up with Sky, I think, uh, a couple of days ago. Okay, so you've been in contact with the uh, managers from One NS Studio from way back. Yeah. Okay. Any other artists in One NS Entertainment? Uh, no, I, I know just Chin Bees. Just, just Chin Bees. Yeah. And, and One NS, I found One NS online. So okay. I came to Tanzania as a virgin, so I didn't know nothing. I didn't know anybody. Okay. Yeah, so it's just me out here on holidays trying to catch fun and maybe do a little bit of music. Okay. Yeah. Anyway, thank you very much for stopping by. <laughs> It's been an honor. It's been a pleasure. I love your music, and I'm super looking forward to your new album. Thank you. Thank you very much. Yes, and yes. there's going to be dope stuff coming out. Once I go back to Cameroon, I'm dropping a video. We'll definitely play it. Yeah, definitely. Thank <laughs> you. <laughs> DJ Poison. We're king of my chin biz. We're your man. I've been a blast. He likes to. Which one should we go with? Kaba Baye. Yeah, Kaba Baye. Thank you very much. You're welcome. Caribou.